Greetings, flesh creatures. It is I, Megatron. On behalf of TFYLP, I want to congratulate you for listening to the most refined collector podcast on this miserable little planet Earth. Yes. Here you'll find knowledgeable fans discussing every aspect of Transformers and beyond. Now, enjoy the show while I continue my path to complete conquest of all of you miserable biological entities. Predacons! Terrorize! Hi, and welcome to Cut the Tape. I'm Rick Alvarez. This is Maddie. This is Casey. We had a heck of an adventure last week cutting up Snake Mountain. That's, that's Snake Castle. Snake Castle, yeah, Snake Castle. Sitting right up there. Daddy. And, uh, oh, yes, Casey. Oh, how many years have you Transformers? How many years have I loved Transformers? Too many. I started collecting, that's a good question, actually. I started collecting professionally in 1994. My freshman year of high school. So, all right, Daddy, girls. When did you start getting these I I swear I could have just I just answered that question. All right. So, this this is Java Sales Barge. This was the first uh, Haslab project. Now, when I worked for Hasbro, I actually worked in a department called Haslab, but it had nothing to do with the Kickstarter S program that it is today. It was the place where we would create and develop our intellectual property. Dad, there's so, a dinosaur bone behind the there's, there's a dinosaur bone up in the ceiling, yes. Yeah. Yep. All right. So, uh, I've been sitting on this for a while. I didn't really have a good reason to open it. We're uh, moving along here in the basement <laughs> where uh, this is the flag that I'm working on. And I thought we would open this up. Okay, Maddie's wearing All right. makeup. Maddie's wearing makeup. All right, you girls ready to open this? Now, before we open this, hang on. Hang on a second. Before we open this, I want to give a little perspective as to just how big this sail barge is. Is it like 12 feet? Is it a transformer? It is not 12 feet. And this is not a transformer. This is a Star Wars item. This is the, the skiff. All right, the little thing that flies adjacent to the... I'm not. I'm going to surprise you. And then, if you girls do a good job, we can watch Return of the Jedi later, where you can actually see this toy in action. This is the skiff that flies adjacent to the sail barge. And then this is a figure that fits on the skiff. So you can see the scale, right? This is a, I just have a random figure. This is Hondo uh, Unaka. He's from primarily the Clone Wars. He showed up in Rebels. But, Unaka. But, um, he kind of looks like he belongs on Java Sail Barge. So I got him today so I can put him on Java Sail Barge. Unaka kind of sounds like Spanish. Unaka does kind of sound like Spanish. So, you girls remember when, when this came? Maddie, you remember when this came? This thing was so big, it was just towering over you, and you gave it a big hug. Can I try to cut it? So, here we're going to go. All right, Maddie. Maddie, come on over. All right, now remember, Casey, stand back because we have a knife. Now, Maddie, always cut towards your enemies. I never know. cut towards yourself. Never, never cut I towards yourself, cut. and never cut with a razor blade. Never cut fast. All right. I don't even have any. All right. Smooth like your flat, like your. Like all right. So you want to keep it straight, knife. okay? But you don't want to tilt it. You, you don't want it to, all right, well, I'm gonna hold you, okay? I'm just telling you, before I pick you up, you wanna hold it straight, not at an angle, okay? It's, you wanna hold it straight. All right, so take it with one hand, slide that in, and, oh, it's been cut. <laughs> uh, Casey is going to cut the other side. Casey, why don't you go on the other side for me? Whew. All right. Sorry. Let's, yeah, let's not give anyone the middle finger. Casey, No, I put it right in there. All right. All 
Remember to keep the, the blade level. You want to get in between the, the box, not here. You know what? We're gonna do it this way because this spot, this corner is a little bent. Let me see. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. I know you didn't cut towards yourself. All right, Casey, why don't you come over here again? All right, so girls, girls, I don't know what's inside because I've never seen any reviews. Is it another chicken? It's not another, no, we have enough chickens. Mm -hmm. So I've Wait never seen an unboxing of this before. Sure. Now this is an older toy. All right, this is, is it, a. Is it um, Alpha? Okay, so first impression, good job Hasbro. We talked about the great job that Super 7 did last week with our Snake Mountain and how impeccably, hang on, I'm talking. How impeccably perfectly it was packed. I don't even know if that word structure makes sense, but it was beyond perfect how well Snake Mountain was packed. Now, the first thing I'm seeing is there is a box inside the box. Girls, 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 we're gonna level zero. Level zero, okay, because I'm about to open this box. All right, so the first thing I see, stop, stop. So the first thing I see is, a box in a box. Watch, Maddie, look. So let's turn this box over. All right, Casey and Maddie, can you girls get on that side? And we're going to, I'm going to need your help lifting this box up. All right. Maddie on one side, Casey on the other. And we're going to shimmy it. Shimmy. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. No, 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 hang on, girls. Grab it. See where my hands are? Yeah. Right here. Right here. There we go. Yeah. Ooh. I can't Ooh. read. I can't read. Ooh. It's like a coffin. All right. What the fuck? this box is. Look, how Look at the size of this box. Look how big this box is. Is it taller than me? It is. It is taller than you. Can you fit inside? Oh. Good. Let's mail. Let's um, let's mail her far, go. far away. Yeah, mail, mail us let's, together. Come on. Let's Maddie. mail you far, far away. All right. Let's flip this thing back over. Actually, let's not. Bye. I mail you. So there is a. It looks like there's a random piece of tape just attached to it. That's just a random piece of trash. All right. So, I'm guessing this is the top, this is the bottom. If we cut the bottom, we'll have a nice, beautiful presentation. Now, I'm going to cut at an angle because I don't want to risk cutting whatever's inside. I think, I think there's a box inside, like a vintage style box. And I don't want to damage that. Now, I'm not really a Star Wars collector per se, but I do enjoy collecting the vehicles. Yes! Yes! Oh! -ho -ho -ho! All right. So, Hasbro gets points. Hasbro gets points. All right, come on out. Come on out, and it's time to be quiet. Come on out, because we're... Oh! You okay? You hit your own daughter. Oh my God! Would you stop, <laughs> Maddie? Watch, now Maddie. You're gonna like you're gonna be anymore. the first person to see this. Look. All right. Now watch what happened here. They've taped this right where you're gonna cut it, so when you cut it, you don't damage the box. That I appreciate. And they've taped it so that this won't slide out of position. All right, girls. Ooh, this is big. This is big. Now, I have never seen one of these in person. Ooh, are you girls ready? All right, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to move this out of the way. No, we want to nail ourselves tomorrow. I'm going to put that 
on top of the state mountain box. Girls, I need you to go to the other side. To Casey, Casey, this way. I need you to go to the other side. And mail ourselves. We're going to keep the box, all right? All right, now, Casey, lift this box. Lift it. Put your hands underneath. Pick it up. All right. Now, I'm going to turn it like this. And I want you girls to lift that box. And here... It's like a coffin inside a coffin. It's like a coffin inside of a coffin. And another coffin inside another coffin. And there it is. Here it is. Java Sail Barge. The Katana. Hang on a second. Casey. What? Get on that side. Is Maddie, this? get on that side. But it's the same thing as that put, thing. Put your hand underneath it. Underneath, not on the side. And we're going to turn it. You know, maybe I can just do this by myself. All right. They're not the same thing. They're not the same thing. And I'm going to show you because we're going to open this too. But it's a ship. It's a ship. Does the characters come with it? Hang on a second. Hang on a second. Oh. Girls, you need to be level zero right now. All right. And I'm going to show you what's inside the box. All right. Hello, camera. Casey, that's unexpected behavior. Okay. Casey, I did the camera. All right. Here we go. This is what we're going to do. Casey, I need you to stand on that side. Hello. All right. Hello. That's unexpected behavior, girls. What are we doing? Just wait right there, all right? Because you two are the audience, and we're going to open this after we open this. Not if you don't listen. All right, so let's see here. We have some folds. Yeah. They can see your hand. Casey, I'll, please stop that. Maddie, level zero. All right. I'm going to need to get my knife. I'm going to use the dull edge of my knife to slide it underneath so that I don't rip the box. I want you both to be quiet. I want you both to be quiet so that you can get rewarded later. All right? That means being quiet. I, it means being quiet. All right, let's see here. Final flap. Oh, okay, so there's two flaps on the side. Maddie, please stop. You're moving the table. Put your hand down. All right, here we go. Daddy. Casey, no talking right now. All right, girls, are you ready? Whoa. really special. Do you girls want to come over here and look? Do you want to see how this is packaged? Yeah. All right, so what we're going to do is we'll lean it down so that our friends at home can see inside. And there it is. Whoa. I am not sure how to remove this from the box. Okay, all right. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. All right. All right, here we go. So, styrofoam piece comes out. Not easy peasy. Okay. All right, Casey, Maddie, I need your help. Yeah. All right. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. It says read before unpacking. There is something here. I want to see. Want me to look you up? That says read before unpacking. 
Okay, you want to see it? All right. I can So look at that. That is a giant ship, and there's stuff. No, we're not doing that. And there's stuff inside, all right? So. That, no, these are two different things. These are two different things. Now, we got to see what's in here. They're both ships. They're both ships, they yes. Yes, but they're very different ships, and they're very different price points. All right, so let's see. Stop before, read before unpacking. Here. All right. Girls, quiet so I can listen. I can read this. So, find support feet antenna, engine detail, accessory box. Attach support feet. Support feet must be attached prior to attaching fins. Okay. Not in that box, please. No. All right. So these are the assembly instructions, and they're very. I mean, they're like practically yelling at it at you. Do this first before you doing the other thing. All right. So I'm not even sure how I'm going to take this out of the box. Now, girls, when I take this out of the box, I think I need you two to move this box. All right? I'll let you know, okay? Give a thumbs so, up. So stand up. Oh! Oh, there we go. Whoa! All right. Casey, I need you... Take this box. Hang on, hang on. And gently put it on the floor. You can put it on its side, it's gonna be okay. Alright. So no, we're not opening this character. This is Yak Face. We got a special carded yak face. Because I'm gonna keep that one carded. All right, we've got a job of the hut, and you can open job of the hut. All right, but you have to come down and be at level zero. All right, each of you have a character to open. I want to open a girl. All right, but I don't have any girl characters to open. So here we go. Let's see what's in here. All right. Ooh. So the sails are actual fabric. I was not expecting that. Uh, I really was not expecting that. This is called styrofoam. There's not a whole lot of styrofoam these days. We're going to take that off. No. Because this is part of the toy. And I'm going to keep it in the box. You know, when I was a kid, I used to use styrofoam inserts. And I used to pretend they were bases. Let's not play with it and let's not break it. Okay? Then you don't play with it and you won't break it. I'm not going to play with it and I'm not going to break it. Alright, here we go. Because, you know what, that's a lesson for another day. Girls, here it comes. Here comes the ship. Look at the size of this. All right, so I'll explain to you why it has those things. It has these layers of tape of plastic wrap on it so that these panels don't fall off. This is a ship. Now, before we take these, before we cut these, the instructions tell us that we need to put We need to put these clear bases. It's always good to refer to the instructions. Always. Why does it say tattoo on? It's uh, pronounced Tatooine. And Tatooine is a desert planet in the outer rim system. Oh, oh, Daddy, I can see if 
Yes, I think so. All right, so we need a little bit of a reset here with the girls, right? And both of them are going to come over and be nice, and we're going to be at level zero. All right. Now, I'm going to have toys for both of you to open, but only if you girls are nice. So, let's see. We have installed the antenna, the front antennas and the feet. Now, it's asking us, or it's directing us to install anchors. Find the support feet antenna, engine detail in the accessory box, attach support feet, blah, 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 blah. Did we find them all? We found them all. Okay. Oh, I think we dropped a little piece right there. Right there, girls. All right, so we got a bunch of little pieces here. We got a bunch of chains. I think this chain has wrapped around, yep, this larger piece. All right, so the chain, one chain there. We have these two pieces. Other chains. We have pegs. All right. And peg. All right. So we need three pegs. We've got our three pegs. Our three pegs are going to go in the back. Look, th this is what I'm talking about when I say a peg. It is microscopic. All right, so one. Maybe we shouldn't even put these in because they may just get lost. Two. Three. And now the anchors, this anchor, There. Now we're going to tilt it on its side. Oh my gosh. Oh. Take these two anchors. So we need to attach the side fins, which are these parts here. Can one of you hold this? All right, so let's see. This one. Uh, yep. Ooh. All right. 
so these are the fins that go on the side. It's saying to attach guns, side cannons. We have two side cannons. Where is our knife? Right here. All right. Maddie, can you take the knife and cut that bag open? Excellent. Why do they look like glass? Uh, so, well, the reason those uh, pieces look like glass, it's so that it looks like it's kind of floating. Are these the right cannons for this? Side. I think so. Oh, so here's something interesting on the instructor. It says, collector's notes. For those collectors who own the Star Wars Black Series Vism figure and cannon, there are four C-clip ports to connect Vism cannons. So... These are the ports, one, two, three, four. I'm gonna to need to find those characters. Excellent. All right, so now, take our large cannon. Why can I open it? Hang on. That looks like a large pot. That is Jabba the Hutt. Does this move? I can't even see the face. <laughs> so I wonder if this moves. It doesn't look like it moves. I want to believe that it moves. How else will you shoot it down into the ship? Alright. So we got our cannon. Now, we're going to move on to the dangerous part. Before we do that, girls, why don't we look at all the features? All right, so let's, let's see here. All of these little panels open up, right? Not all of them, most of them do. By most of them, I mean some. Some of these panels open up, right? This one. These little doors up here open up. Wait, is there are staircases to those little doors. Is this like for when they shoot cannons? Yep, they can shoot out of there. They can they can see what's going on. There's a trap door here. I wonder if there's a button to release that. Those are windows. So what we're going to do before we put the sails on? There's like some steps to like, like you know, like. Oh! Under here you girls like missed it. There. You girls missed it. So watch what I'm going to do. Oh, there's a brig on the inside. What? Do you mean? what? Oh! Oh, that's awesome. I wish I could show this to you. Wait, what's inside? Let me see. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. All right, so inside, there's a set of, and I, it's funny, because I have the character here. Here is Hammerhead, right? And there's a set of bones inside here, right? And then you press this button, and then the door opens, and you fall into the brig. That is hilarious. Can I try? Wait, what do you mean? Like, wait, I think I know what you mean, Jim. Hang on a second. Hang on. It's a, it's a little weird to try and get it in there, but all right. So this panel comes off, and now you girls. God, those are stairs. Now you girls can see inside, and then this panel comes off. And what we'll do is we'll turn it so that our friends at home can see. Is this live? All right, back up a second. This is not live. We're recording. 
So now our friends at home can see that there's a whole playset interior. What are these things? Um, those are little doors and decorations and stuff. Yeah, I see it. Look, All right. Uh, All right. Hang on a second. Hang on a second. How do you open those? All right. Now we won't mess around too much with the inside for the for the purposes of the of the fill of the episode. Wait, it looks like some rooms there. Yeah, there's some rooms in here. Oh, what is this? A bed? A that's room? a bed. Yep, that's Jabba's bed, where Jabba the Hut can take a nap. Oh look! You can go. Hello. Do you see my fingers? I would have loved this as a kid. This My dolls will Well, your dolls can play with this only if you girls are acting nice. But does it come with characters? We'll get there. Well, what's the we will get there. The that, that is called a fin. So what we're trying to do is put this back on. This is the front. This side's the front. Wait, what so we have an extra piece of panel. How do you drive it? Hang on a second. Hang on a second. First, we got to finish putting it together. Is this plastic? Yes, it's all plastic, honey. Level zero. All right. So. Take this. Hang on, Casey. Hang on a second. Because the sails are fabric, which I was not expecting, we have to build the skeletal structure for the Wait, for the sails to fit slide? on. It's not a slide. Hang on a second. Wait, is that like the street? Just hang on a second, and you'll see what it is. Okay. Okay. Instructions were a little clearer. Oh, okay. Well, all right, so we have this part now. Hey, girls, level zero. Let's see here. Let's um, Maddie. Food. So. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Boom, boom, boom. Chats the small braces to main horizontal beam shown in figure one. Snap the main horizontal beam. Wait, I know what those beams are. It's a door. Yes, they're a door. All right, let's take a break for a second. All right, so we've had some time. These were a little bit tricky. The instructions don't do a really good job of explaining them to you or how to pop off the front panel to get access to the cockpit. But we were able to figure it out. So I think they could have done a little better job with the instructions, but here it is. Here is the 
final piece of the sail that goes on the sail barge. And what I really like about this is that everything is meant to come back apart so it can fit once again into that box. Let's put this piece on here. So this is the largest Star Wars vehicle ever made, so far, and it only took 40 years for us to get this vehicle. Here it is, Java Sail Barge. Look at the size of this thing. Is it heavy? It's very heavy. Do you want to try and pick it up? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's super heavy, right? It comes with an exclusive job of the Hut figure. He looks like Ghostbusters. We're gonna open him in a second. But I thought we would open here, Casey, why don't you open this character up? So we can show people at home. You can just rip it open if you want. Twenty-five year old figure just Ripping it open. Actually, this is from 1995. I was a freshman in high school. You're in high school? Yep. So I'll show you how this weapon goes. Actually goes like that. So this is Hammerhead. And just to show you, you can't even see him. You can't even see him. He's so tiny. He's so tiny. There's no pegs here for you to place a figure on. You should go on top of the roof and just like... You should go on top of the roof? No. No, that doesn't work for me. That doesn't work for me. Alright. Those are just little details. Alright. But something else we're going to open... Oh, is the Tatooine Skiff. All right, let's put these instructions away. We'll put these away nice and neat in a little bit. But I just want to see the Tatooine skiff, how how it compares in size. All right. Wait, is there Can a you, There's no figures in this. All right, so you have to put, this is the sharp end. You got to put it in like that. Cut away from you. Well, it's a good thing I don't collect Star Wars boxes because we cut the box. Well, that's okay. Let's see here. All right. So this is a brand new Tatooine skiff. Look at the detail. Yeah, look at all these details. Look, I mean, just look at the set. We'll come around to the other side. We're going to put it together. Maybe, maybe you should put it under there, and then you can just pretend like they're speaking. They're putting like a chain in there, and then like an extra for like emergencies. Oh, like a lifeboat? Yeah. Okay. Maybe that. Is this a um, table shaped as a Star Wars ship? Oh, this is going to be our G.I. Joe ship, the USS Flag. All right, so let's see here. 62 episodes, and I don't think I've ever cut myself. Is this your 63rd? I think this is my 62nd episode. Huh? So... This goes... Hmm. He's going to be like... They could be. And then you can just paint them with a line. All right. Let's just throw this together real quick. We don't need to get into any explaining on this. What's this? Uh, some extra details. Yes. Not swords, no. Uh, antennas. Oh, Star 
Wars characters do you have in Facebook? How many Star Wars characters do I have? Because uh, I see like billions. Well, those are Transformers. Uh, those, those are actually G.I. Joes. But I see Transformers on them. With the face. So, but you asked how many Star Wars characters I have. Yeah. Not a whole lot. Yeah. Oh, let me guess. Why do you have a toothbrush in here? Why do I have a toothbrush? Oh, because it's part of the collection. So you have bandits. You should put the hat where the clothes. Alright, what are we doing here? Oh, I see. So they've got the damaged pieces, and then they've got the undamaged pieces. So you can make either sail barge. Hang on a second. This is a tricky piece. Little hoses here that need to click in. Beautiful. A lot of detail on this thing, too. Yeah, you can have that. Uh, let's see here. This it's a ball joint clips in place. Oh, the stand is on a ball joint too. So you can tilt it. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's genius. So then you can use the string and just. This is why I love the vehicles. So I only collect Star Wars vehicles. Uh, I have a couple cars? figures. What are those cars? Um, we'll get there. Those are for something else. So I'm building a Star Wars trench run in my basement. here. Oh, I see. So does this? Oh! I was wondering where the plank was, right? There's the plank. How does it come out? Boom. Is that a last one? Or is this wires? That's just wires. Now I need another one of these. I didn't think about that. I know there were two, but like, I didn't think that this was, see I don't know Star Wars toys that well, that there's the undamaged version, and then there's the damaged version. All right, so here is, that's an extra part. That's an extra part. All right, so Casey. We're going to put our sail barge here, and then That's heavy. look at the size comparison. Okay. Ah! Oh, sorry, I bumped into you. Look at that. I think it actually was like this, right? Yeah. So Jabba's in here, and he's talking to the guys over here, and then... The uh, Sarlacc is in the middle. Oof! Man! This is enormous. So I hang all, so I love the flying vehicles because I'm hanging them from my ceiling, right? This one I cannot hang from my ceiling. I'm not, I'm not going to try and hang it from the ceiling. I'm sure I can figure out how, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to find a nice tall place to display it alongside the skiff and that's it that's cool. what do you think it's big huh oh my gosh it's Did huge you have characters? well i have a bunch of characters because i bought a bunch of characters like a movie? 
I bought a bunch of characters to put on here. You should make like a movie and put like all your transfer. But I need a Boba Fett. I got a feeling after Mandalorian season two, we're gonna get a Boba Fett figure. All right. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Cut the tape. Bye.